The procedure that I had was a hip replacement. Uh, I've been in pain for uh, many years. I am a uh, former Missouri football linebacker. I don't look like it anymore. I'm 40 pounds lighter than I used to be. I lift a lot of heavy weights, which is probably the reason why we're sitting here now. Uh, the heavy squatting and that that you need for football. My hip was in such bad condition that I could not bend down uh, to pick things off the ground. So yard work, anything I needed to pick up, I had to bend s straight over from my back. My hip would not let me bend down. Well, living with the pain became pretty normal, but it took me 10 minutes to get my socks and shoes on every morning. I picked Dr. Nelson, and from the time I met him, he just made me feel super comfortable. He's a kind of a down-to-earth guy. He's very laid back, but to the point on what, what, what you need to have done. And be it that I'm a person of faith, it was really important that DePaul was a faith-based hospital. And before the nurses started to roll me out of my bed down the hall, uh, Dr. Nelson said, if you don't mind, I'd like to say a little prayer before we go in. And that, that was the ultimate thing that made me feel comfortable going into surgery, um, along with the anesthetic when they put me out. <laughs> I would recommend that anyone that is going through chronic pain, and if you have bone-on-bone -bone joints, you know what I'm talking about. Don't waste a minute being in pain when there are procedures that can be done they are going to make you feel alive again and make you feel like you can do things you haven't done in years. And uh, I'm 53, I hope to live at least hopefully another 25, 30 years and I plan to be mobile and be able to do things for the rest of my life that I wouldn't have been able to do if I didn't get the replacement done.